There is a secret about Tesla's next battery gigafactory and I want you to know it. And the secret is that Tesla factory could make Quebec in Canada a global battery hub. Welcome back friends. This is Armin Haryan from talknews.com. Charles Morris has published a very interesting story in evanex.com saying speculation continually buzzes around the world about the possible location of Tesla's next gigafactories. Why not Quebec? The Can Canadian province is arguably an ideal location for large-scale battery production and its government has enacted a number of EV-friendly measures. Quebec is rich in critical battery metals and has plenty of cheap and clean hydropower. The provincial government is heavily incentivizing the extraction of key minerals such as lithium, nickel and graphite and recently announced plans to invest up to look at this 3 billion Canadian dollars in battery production. That's 2.4 billion dollars in US dollars in battery production. Now, uh, Lion Electric has planning, actually is planning to build a 5 gigawatt hour battery factory in Quebec and companies including Namaska Lithium and Nouveau Monde Graphite have launched products to produce and refine graphite and lithium. Now, Electric reports that uh, the Quebec government is in talks with Tesla about possibly establishing battery production in the province. And this is the secret. Tesla has already indirectly invested in Quebec's lithium resources through a deal with Piedmont Lithium, which is involved with a lithium project in Quebec, uh, Quebec's um, ABTB region. Quebec Economy Minister Pierre Fitchborn met with Tesla executives during a mission in California last month, said a spokesperson. They discussed Quebec's place in in Tesla's supply chain. That was a quote. The journal de Montreal uh, Le Journal de Montreal reported that talks have been moving forward over the last few months. That was a quote too. So is Tesla just looking for lithium or might Quebec be the site of the next gigafactory? No details are on offer at this point, but I would like to hear what you think about this new kind of secret. Remember, Tesla factory, based on all of this, could make Quebec a global battery hub. So will Tesla build its next gigafactory to build 4680 batteries in Quebec? Let me know your thoughts, friends. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news. This is Armin Harayan from torquenews.com. Please visit us on our website, uh, ring the bell so you don't miss our uh, my next coverage. And also please uh, give us thumbs up if you like this report. Have a great day. Peace be with all of you. God bless you. And let's move on to our next Tesla story. Tesla updates Cybertruck. This is a big news today. Elon Musk confirmed confirmed on Twitter that Tesla is updating the Cybertruck with a four motor configuration that is going to enable independent power at each wheel and four wheel steering with crop mode like the Hammer EV. This means Tesla will start Cybertruck production at Giga Texas with new quad motor variant. Welcome back dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news. Tesla CEO Elon Musk today confirmed that the all-electric Cybertruck will have a quad motor variant. That means four motor variant, which will take production priority at Gigafactory Texas when manufacturing of the Cybertruck begins. So this was a big update today on Cybertruck. Musk also stated that thanks to the Cybertruck's front and rear wheel drive modes, the pickup, like I said, will have a diagonally uh, diagonal like uh, crab mode, uh, the driving moving diagonally like a crab like the Hummer EV. Tesla's Cybertruck was unveiled in 2019 and was supposed to have three powertrain options for purchase, a single, dual, and tri-motor. However, after over 1.2 million pre-orders for the Cybertruck had been accumulated, Tesla essentially shut down the Cybertruck's online configurator, giving the impression that major changes were to come for the all-electric pickup truck from Tesla. 
Evidently, rumors started to swirl that Tesla would scrap the single motor variant in favor of a quad motor powertrain, like I said, quad means four, four motor powertrain, which would join the dual and tri-motor setup Tesla already is offering. Now, Elon Musk has confirmed that the, there will be a quad motor Cybertruck and production will begin with this variant at Gigafactory Texas. Holmar's catalog, Holmar's blog, room, uh, wrote on December 2nd that uh, rumor has it that the Cybertruck is no longer configurable on the Tesla side because they are debating getting rid of the single motor version and having only two, three, and four motor variants. To this, Elon Musk on December 3 at 10.55 5 a.m. today um, commented saying initial actually December 3 was yesterday initial production will be four motor variant with independent ultra fast response torque control of each wheel there is no evidence currently that Tesla will completely ditch the single motor powertrain but it had the least amount of reservations on the online pre-order tracker do we have anyone in our community that has ordered the single motor powertrain if yes let me know what you think and why you chose the single motor friends it appears that quad motor four motor cybertruck will have four independently controlled motors attached to each wheel just as the rivian r1t has this increases the cybertruck's um, performance in off-road settings and or when confronted with challenging terrain. It increases torque vectoring and response as well, which makes the ve uh, vehicle more confident with it is, um, when it is traveling over tough road conditions. Musk also stated that the front and rear wheel steering capabilities will enable diagonal driving like a crab mode. As you know, GM has indicated that uh, its Hummer EV will have crab mode, which effectively will help the vehicle improve its capabilities over difficult terrain. And, uh, and uh, Marv, the Twitter user, asked Elon Musk, could it turn like a tank? Elon Musk responded on December 3 saying we'll have both front and rear wheel steering so not just like a tank it can drive diagonally like a crop after tesla shut down the configuration options on the cybertruck design studio most knew that changes were likely on the way tesla could launch the cybertruck as soon as december 2022 but some have speculated that with tesla's offloading of cybertruck inspired uh, merchandise in its online shop that the cyber Cybertruck could be coming to the market sooner than anticipated. But I think the Cybertruck will come once Tesla starts building its own 4680 batteries en masse. And now, a couple of weeks ago, Elon Musk said that uh, Tesla has two constraints that delays the new products, and one of them was the battery supply and the battery. So we'll have to wait until uh, Tesla's Gigafactory Texas start building uh, batteries, and also Giga Berlin starts building batteries. We know Giga Berlin is about to be approved, but I don't know where the battery production facilities construction starts right now. If you guys know any updates, let me know. I'm going to follow on that to see where the Giga Berlin battery construction facility stands right now i will ask our german friends today on twitter and uh, maybe report them tomorrow let me know your thoughts friends on the four motor cyber truck new update on cyber truck from elon musk and tesla this is armin harayan from torquenews.com please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla electric vehicle news coverage have a great day peace be with all of you god bless you everyone and i'll see you soon in our next report